be. Our grand finals was off the chains, off the chains. We're gonna try and uh, play it. Let's let's play some grand finals. So me and Spiro. Is Tekken Seven King the best version of King? Uh, no, he's not. Wow, so the start of the set. Spiro used to love this outfit, this Tiger Jackson outfit. He would take it to any tournament with him. Any tournament, he had that Tiger Jackson outfit. Because back then, you could plug in your USB um, flash drive and bring your outfits with you. That was such a godlike feature. I didn't have mine at the time, so I just played with default blue and white. What's up, Tim Fulbis? What's going on, bro? Well, I, I'm not even trying to align myself. I'm just attacking into the distance. Wow. He was just playing with GM yesterday. And there it is, the hop kick. Man, his execution. Yo, Tim Fuibis, could you do that combo back then? Or did you even play Tekken back then? I don't know. Solid punishment. Again, King's punishment was just decent at best in this game. It wasn't godlike how it is now. All he can give was 1 2 or 2 1. Back one, he didn't have an extension, you know, he didn't have the back one, two. Yo, Thousand Boy, thanks for those gift subs. Yeah, no back one, two. Man, movement, so good. I miss this, I miss this stuff. I mean, I know I can't do it now, you know, because the whole scene is so, so different. It's esports now, guys. You know, you can't do the, the trash talking like you used to be able to, and you know, it wasn't, it wasn't always so, um, I guess, soft back then. If that's the right word to use. It wasn't so soft back then. Yeah, that was the punish for Death Fist back three. Oh Lord, I didn't know. Um, didn't kill him when I had the chance. Yeah, Spiro's always had a paw. There it is. The the half stream down four. You see that? <laughs> that was down four. Four. Not down four plus four, but you had to hold down for it for a split second and then you hit four and he'll do a a super down four. Yo, Headmaster Squall, thanks for the sub, sir. Oh my god. This execution of mine. I I want it back, guys. I want it back. Man, I want it back. I almost got hit by that unblock move. Yeah, and that is why you don't down back three, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, yeah, throwback Tekken. Welcome, guys, welcome. Uh, I tried to um, punish something that wasn't that punishable. Yeah, you see down forward, um, let me go back real quick to show you guys some good King stuff. That right there, down forward, one, two, if he delayed it, it was safe. Safe against everybody. He no longer has that option. It was a nerf for no reason at all. <laughs> but now it's possible no matter what. Yeah, this was 2008. 
Do you feel like you can't get your execution back? I think I can get it back with lots of uh, practice. Oh God, the thruster on counter hit. Oh my goodness. See, he wasn't um, wasn't ready with Eddie. What had what happened to my execution? See, back then I was like, um, I didn't have anything to do back then. Like pretty much all of high school, I was doing a whole lot of practicing with Tekken. Early years in in college, Tekken, you know. Oh, I tried to take his head off. But nowadays, you know, even even with 2018, when you guys saw my Evo run, even then, most of that year, my practice wasn't anywhere near as, you know, extensive as it was when I was younger. Oh, God. What? Look at that. Look at this knowledge back then. I had <laughs> I had execution and knowledge of so much stuff. You probably can't even do that anymore. I think I was uh, 19 at this tournament. I tried to do a down forward two from Crouch, but the stupid glitch happened. Yeah, I tried to go for a wall carry. Oh, look at the, the wolf punish. Again, King's down four is nothing like this now. You see the range? Hold on, hold on. I'm gonna slow it down. I'm gonna slow it down. I have to slow it down again. Let me turn the sound off. Look at the range, guys. <laughs> he darts across the screen with that. And it was pretty much safe. It's like a Kara down four. Yeah, yeah, the big Vitus. Vitus, yeah. That's exactly what it used to be. Kind of like a Kara down four. That's the perfect term for it. It did more damage. It had more range. It was safer. It was way better than down... Four. Okay, just go for an easy combo for the kill. I was a dash jab specialist. Like, really? So, was that, um, I don't even know what set that was. 1A. I guess I have to look for 1B, maybe? I guess it was 1B, okay. Yeah, going through the history books looking at my first major victory. No, it, it definitely wasn't a thousand boy. It wasn't a normal down four at all. This might be the first time him coming to a major tournament. I think I probably was feeling myself at, at the beginning of this set. <laughs> Ah, Jesus. Look at that damage. I'm trying to go all the way back. From a regular pickup, almost half life. Down four, four was safe. See, if I knew the concept of wave dashing back then, that down four would have came out a lot more. <laughs> Still was weak to relax, you know. If you were in range, it was a mix. Yeah, Eddie was so good back then. Still good now, obviously. Okay, I'm getting my stuff pushed in.
That was the best punish King had back then. <laughs> While standing forward into a alley kick. Because there was no down forward, you know, 4-3. I missed it. Oh, my God. How did I let him come back with that? I'm disappointed in my young self. Yo, Will Maddox, thanks for the three months, sir. Yeah, this is me and Spiro. What's up, Emery? Taking a trip to memory lane. Got some throwback Tekken. Oh my God. You hear the, you hear the uh, commentary? The commentary were the people behind you playing. Wasn't so eSports, you know, back then. Cause people, you know, streaming, I don't even think streaming was big back then. 2008 I think justin.tv was the only thing that was open um, justin.tv and maybe it was one more I don't remember what the name of it was I think there were like two streaming platforms back then see this matchup was so hard I think I had tried to go for something. I have to show you guys whatever. Hold on. This instance right here, like when you throw them away and throw them back in, that down forward too, if I would have timed it correctly, it would have knocked down. Don't ask me why, but it knocked down. And if they take roll, they would get up back turn. Yeah, I had um, tech upon tech upon tech. Who did you play in Tekken Tag? Oh, I played with um, both Kings. I've always used both Kings in uh, both Tekken Tag games. If they make a Tekken Tag 3, which we know they aren't, it'll be both Kings on that as well. The movement was so much better back then. Besides, just got behind his back so easy. These dash jabs, man. Oh, wow. Oh, I almost got him with a cross up. Yeah, that was a setup. I didn't follow through with it. No round brown before the no round brown was actually, you know, a thing. I don't know. I would. I don't know. Um, Isaac Lock. I don't know. Yeah. If he does a regular one, it's fake. Yeah. Positive, bro. Do it after that fucking team player from ATL ran through us. Okay. Okay. You guys hear that? You guys hear that? From ATL ran through us. One, it's fake. Yeah. From ATL, I wonder who they're talking about. I wonder who they were talking about. Bingo, Doctor Strange, love bingo. That was um, M E Red Atlanta back then. He wasn't Mike ATL. So he was telling, uh, I think uh, Realist was telling Spiro some inaccurate information. That one. Yeah, he was telling them that forward three was punishable on block. <laughs> oh, look at that round, guys. Look at this round. How many moves do you need to win, guys? That one. Someone type the amount of moves you need to win. <laughs> I count two. 
Oh lord. That move was godlike. Yeah, back then, back then, this was the best quality you were gonna get. 2008 for tournaments, FGC. Everything looked like this back then. Yeah, that round I did three moves all together. Down four, alley kicking four, three. <laughs> Kings, his, his throw game was so scary because you lost so much health back then. You have more opportunities to make mistakes in taking seven. So yeah, and plus with every throw, you know, you have to break the right way. Crazy. What's up, Brandon? Thanks for the uh, 21 months, three months in a row now. This video footage is probably before your time. <laughs> Probably before your time. Well, let me know if it is, though. Man, my execution. Exactly. Tell him, Dr. Strange Love. Tell him. But you guys can see it, though. I had godlike execution. Have patience. Look at that. That does not exist. You see the range on, on the push? That's, that's no longer a factor in Tekken 7. That move has been nerfed beyond imagination. Look at the push's range. It is so neutered. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. All right, back to the grand finals. Let's look at um, two-way. Memory lane, memory lane. The best move King had in this game by far. That's a third of his bar gone from one forward three. Yeah, that would have been the round if he would have got hit by that. Oh, I tried to, I tried to get him with the, uh, with the combo ender. Oh well. Yeah, I'm a big fan of One Piece, dude. I've been watching so much, uh, like One Piece theories and stuff like that during the downtime. Learning so much about what I didn't watch of it. Oof. The movement on this game was just so fast. So fast. It's like those crouch dash multis were so hard to see coming. They're a lot more telegraphed in the uh, Tekken 7. Alright, here's the punish. Unscaled 30 damage running power bomb every time. Oh, I dropped it. You're out on injury. What happened to you, Brandon? Now, this was just an outfit, uh, Big Majin. Tiger? This was just an outfit. It was, there was no buff. But Eddie did have more range than Christy. Oh goodness, I got opened up. Look at that, that movement. Oh, I tried to get too fancy right there. Wow, the micro side step in the four or three. Dash line swing. Way less telegraphed back then. <laughs> I think he was starting to crack right there, Spiro Jen. 
What set is this? Yeah, 2A, okay. Yeah, customs were allowed, Oblivious. No, no, no. Give me a tick as, as a matter of fact, you could um, you could load your customizations on the uh, flash drive and bring them with you. I started dropping combos left and right. Yeah, the punish for that back then was a dash up hop kick. I'm just amazed at this. I haven't watched this video in a while. It's been years. That wasn't the optimal counter hit combo, but definitely since he was already dead, that's why I did a simple while standing for. Wow, mid crush. I don't know why they missed. Yeah, the Oki, the Oki from Eddie's throw, his two break, ridiculous. You almost were always forced to just lay there and take that. Oh, the giant swing. Again, untackable. Guaranteed uh, down back three. But yeah, let me uh, see. Brandon, what happened? What happened? The knee pop. Ugh. Man, get well soon, man. You, my brother, both of you guys. Heal up. Heal up. Try to have as much fun while you can doing it. Because I know they're, they're going to really, really want you uh, back at work as soon as, as soon as possible. Yeah, I had plenty of um, hop kicks and forward threes for the entire world. All right, last set. In case some of you people don't know what a king winning looks like, that's what it looks like <laughs> way back then. You guys, yeah, we knew about Koreans back then. As a matter of fact, uh, I wanna say q actually came to America before. In DR, and he was having a hard time with Bronson and such. Yeah, Koreans and Japanese they came over here two consecutive years for taking 5.0 and lost to Crow Steve both years. Yeah, Crow was a two time back to back Evo champion, and I want to say uh, he's the He's the only one, if I can remember correctly. Because I know Arsenal and Nash has won Evo Japan and Evo. But Crow won Evo one year, and then he won the next year. So that was that was huge. But it was 5.0 Steve, so, you know, it was pretty unfair. All the cross-ups. Yeah, back then, guys, tournaments were best uh, four out of seven in grand finals. Which was a pretty darn big jump from, like, the regular pool play and uh, the later rounds of the tournaments. They were all first to two. But then once you got to grand finals, it was first to four. So that was pretty crazy. And the uh, winner's finals was three out of five. Real crazy stuff back then. Yeah, Justin Wong won a final round with uh, Feng Wei over Anakin. Still to this day, I don't I don't know how that happened because that was that was young Anakin. You know, I mean Anakin is still pretty young now, but I'm talking about young, young, like younger than glaciating now. Oh yes. Oh no. Dropping the kill combos. Let's see if it costs me. 
There it is, the full range down four. <laughs> Saving the day. That move got me out of so many tight spots. Yeah, we were both like terrified of each other. Like if you can look at how long it took in between like movements before we actually approached each other, it was crazy. How uh, Cody talking trash in the background. He offered to help Spiro. Yeah, back three was all you got on counter hit. So you gotta turtle him back. <laughs> yeah, that was before the uh, stagger, the slippery kicks. Definitely a stagger now. You had to know your stuff. You still need to know your stuff, but you really had to know it back then. Because, like I said, you died quickly on this game. The Oki in this game was just so unforgiving. You had to break all throws with the correct buttons. And you had fewer frames to break them. You didn't have 20 frames like you do now. You had uh, 15, if I want to say. If I remember correctly, I think it was 15 frames. So that broken Falcon round throw and taking seven before they nerfed it. You had to do that all day in this game. You had um, one more frame than that to break it. And you see us, we're breaking throws like mad, man. We're all young in our teens and early 20s. <laughs> Lord. I'm going to watch Tekken 6 as well. I have a victory that I want to show you guys in that too. <laughs> oh lordy. Hit me with the mix. Try the jab punish because you can float it. Yeah, King was <laughs> a god. Yeah, I know you like that one. I know y'all like that one. Way, way back. I had these. I created this. I invented this tactic, guys. That was the first time I hit someone in a tournament set with it, I believe. 19-year-old <laughs> me. Crazy. I think this was the final match of the tournament. Yeah, I think this was the final match of the tournament. Movement was everything. Look at the range on that wheel punish. Yeah, the, the hip boxes and her boxes were so, so much better back in the day. Yeah, all the, the upstate New York people were trying to cheer him on. <laughs> I tried to run up and hop kick. My kick is about to run out, man. I was feeling myself. I can't even lie. I was. <laughs> Still doing it to this day. Oh, I know what I tried to do right there. So, I, I definitely got to play this game and show you guys some stuff. Man, I had so much tech. Yeah, I think this was it right here, guys. Long way home, Spiro. Uh. <laughs> you hear the little pop-off?
I guess whoever was courting it got mad. Was it um the realist? I was like, yeah. <laughs> oh my goodness, I love it. I love it. Taking five. Man, such a such a fun game. The memories were man, they're just unmatched. Unmatched memories. 